this has been a long journey to try to figure out how to help his anxiety levels. So then fast forward to now CBD is like this super popular thing that everyone's trying. And it's, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today's gonna be a little bit of a different video <laughs> because Rocky will be joining Whoa. us. <laughs> what I wanted to talk about with Rocky Whoa. is just um, his anxiety and stuff. So when we got him we got him he's five now so we got him in 2014 and when we got him he was still very expressive like talking a lot and stuff and i just i think the anxiety started growing very soon after we got him i think just certain experiences that he had right off the gate like he we got him from colorado so we had him um, <laughs> we had him flown to us and so I think already like when you're eight weeks old I can only imagine okay okay shh okay okay can you go play I was I thought you were gonna run around so automatically I feel like you know being a puppy that can can't be an easy experience to go right into that so Anyways, so the anxiety started growing like more whenever we would leave the house. His breed in general, he just like, he's a pack dog, so he likes to have his pack and he obviously made us his pack. So anytime he's not with us or we're not with him, it's like he's freaking out. And so another thing is with him, he like requires a lot of exercise and we do like every single day, he'll come on a run with us and when we've been here, like the first day that we were here, we both ran, I mean, I think he ran like 10 miles. I ran with him for five and then Steven ran, a, w ran with him for five. And so I definitely feel like his case of anxiety is like very high. We talked to our vet and he gave us these. And I have every single thing that we've tried with me right now because this has been this has been a long journey to try to figure out how to like help his anxiety levels when we're not with him. It's gotten even worse now to where he'll even have anxiety just in general, like constantly. It's just a very you can tell he's he's on edge. Right, let me see if I can get him in the in the frame here. Alright, so anyways, this is the first thing that we tried. It's called Composure Pro supports calm behavior and brain health canine and feline so that's what that looks like so we tried this for a while we still have a few left in here um i really don't think it did much so like the main ingredient in this is thiamine and i think that that's the same stuff like that's in turkey that kind of makes you tired after thanksgiving or at least that's what he kind of made it seem like it was so this was a no-go so then fast forward, I mean, that was, we tried that when he was probably a year and then we tried that continuing on until we finally just stopped. I mean, this has 60 chews that come in here and we didn't use all of them. Like there's still probably like five left. So then fast forward to now CBD is this super popular thing that everyone's trying and it's like natural and there's a lot of benefits to it for dogs as well as humans. So. Now that it's legal in Texas, we bought some of this. This is CBD doggy treats. So we bought this in Lubbock, Texas. So keep that in mind. But Rocky did not take these very well. Like he was not very interested. Like it's not like, oh, I'm so excited to get this treat. Not having it. So we still have this pretty much full bag full. I think he maybe had two. Um, I really didn't see any change in him from these so last week when we got to Breckenridge we had already gone to a CBD store um, like the last time we were here and seen that they have pet CBD and so we went back and we got him these treats the the place that it's called it's called farm strong p h a r m strong and they actually sell online too so these are the treats they have two milligrams of the cbd per treat and then the other thing that came with the package was this it's the drops 
So two drops is 1.1 milligram. And you're supposed to, like you're able to give two to four drops twice a day per 10 pounds of body weight. So Rocky's almost 20 pounds, so we can give him two drops. But he also did say like, that's just kind of like the base thing. And if you don't feel like they're like, you know, reacting to it well, then you can try one more drop or vice versa, whatever. Let me just say, the first two days that we tried the CBD treats and the drops, we didn't really see much of a difference. But then, like day three, it was like a noticeable difference. We have had a lot of success with these. If you've got a dog that's like super high anxiety, like in certain situations, like out in public or even just like when you're leaving the house, you should really like look into CBD and all that it has to offer because it really is becoming more popular and more of like a health thing as far as like, I don't know, for dogs I know it can help like arthritis and like just with anxiety and stuff and I think it could be a serious solution to the problem. Rocky's a really good dog. He just like I don't know like the anxiety it's just like if there's anything that we can do to help him why not you know and so it's kind of been a blessing for us too because we can just like bring him everywhere with us and not think like oh he's having like a panic attack this entire time so anyways yeah so if y'all enjoyed this video or want to see more or know more about um, Rocky then just give this a thumbs up and comment down below and we will see you in the next video bye Like, we talked to our dentist, or not our dentist, oh my gosh. <laughs> we